Greetings and welcome to the ITEA STEM School of Excellence designation presentation. At any time, if you feel as if you have any questions in regards to STEM School of Excellence that was not covered in this video or you just come across at a different time, please feel free to pause this recording and go to the forum to input any questions, comments, or concerns. My name is Ryan Novitsky and my contact information is placed there for additional questions. And my name is Darcy Jones. Please feel free to reach out to us at any time if you have any additional questions. Prior to beginning, I also wanted to state that due to the pandemic, if anybody has been planning or had planned to do some kind of STEM recognition towards the STEM School of Excellence program from mid-March up until June, if they had an event planned, if they were scheduled to go someplace or do something at the school, as long as you show the documentation you were prepping for that and you show any of the paperwork or pictures that were used to promote it along the way, we will take that in consideration to build towards the 200 plus points. That way you could become an ITA STEM School of Excellence because we do recognize that the times are changing and people were planning for things. We want to give accreditation for that. The STEM School of Excellence program helps to recognize outstanding schools for their commitment to providing a robust integrated STEM education program. There are two levels that awards are made towards. The ITA STEM School of Excellence, which is 200 plus points, as well as the ITEA STEM School of Merit, which is 170 to 199 points. Well, what is integrative STEM education? Operationally, it is defined as the application of technological and engineering design based pedagogical approaches to intentionally teach content and practices of technology and engineering education. Integrative STEM education is equally applicable at the natural intersections of learning within the continuum of content areas, educational environments, and academic levels. The application window for the 2019-2020 school year is December 1, 2020. Therefore, what that's referring to is that anything from the 2019 to the 2020 school year that was done, taken in place, that can be accredited towards the STEM School of Excellence will be going towards this program, which will be highlighted and accredited at conference. Applicants will be notified of a decision by January 31st if you qualify to be a STEM School of Excellence or a STEM School of Merit. Awards recipients will be recognized at ITA's conference, and this will be done virtually March 24th to 27th, and you'll be notified as such as far as how you will be highlighted. Awardees will also be recognized in ITEA's flagship journal, Technology and Engineering Teacher, or TET. TET is peer-reviewed and a valuable part of ITEA membership published eight times each year. It is an important tool for technology and engineering education professionals from elementary to high school classroom teachers as well as teacher educators. Well, who should apply? Any school representative may submit the application on a school's behalf. So we encourage all to apply within any portion of the school setting, district, county, etc. Teacher, principal, PTA president, STEM coordinator, district administrator, superintendent, or parent volunteer. How does a school qualify for the award? The application contains a menu of qualifying options. So you're gonna notice that there's a lot of menus to choose from in different sections within the form itself. The school applicant indicates qualifying events that their school has completed during the previous academic year. So again, everything from the 1920 school year is what's going into the form for this year's STEM School of Excellence. It shouldn't be 1819, nor should it be 2021. It should be 1921, 1920 school year. Documentation is uploaded to support each qualifying event. So as you're gathering all of your documentation, please utilize the Google Drive and then place the documents in there and you can place the links directly onto the form itself. And please make sure it is in an organized manner so that way nothing is missed along the way. 
Some qualifying events are ITEA initiatives, while others are non-specific to any organization in or beyond the STEM education community. So therefore, that's referring to is they're specific towards the organization where it may be a membership matter or directly towards the curricula engineering by design. ITA membership is encouraged, but not required for participation. ITA members receive a significant discount on the application fees. Well, here's some qualifying events. STEM career pathways. If your school produces a completer in a STEM career pathway, make sure that this is described in its entirety as far as the completer program. So for instance, if you have the engineering by design program and you have X amount of courses that adhere to your state regulations to make it a completer program for the X amount of years, that needs to be put into there. You need to describe the pathway as far as the requirements and the number of completers in your STEM career pathways, not just one, but all of your completer STEM career pathways that were in the 1920 school year. STEM outreach or community service project. School participates in a STEM outreach or community service project during the 2019-2020 academic year. An example of this would be similar to the Go Baby Go projects that are used nationally that are done at some schools or other community service projects where say for instance, you're building boats to help to serve the community overall. Please make sure you provide a description of project and include photos of you going through and doing your project itself. Teacher collaboration on integrative STEM projects. Two or more teachers collaborated on an integrative STEM project during the 1920 academic year. This can be referring to cross collaborating over different disciplines like te technology and mathematics teachers working together on an integrative STEM project because that's talking about the four different disciplines of science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Provide the teacher's name, subject areas, brief description of project focusing on the integrative nature. Again, integrative is referring to multiple disciplines and blending them together toward the STEM project of the teaching and learning while including your photos. Diversity in STEM education. School sponsored an initiative project focused on diversity in STEM education during the 1920 academic year. Please ensure that you provide a complete description of the project and include photos. Family oriented STEM event. School sponsored a family oriented STEM event during the 1920 academic year. An example of this would be something similar to possibly hosting a PTA night with the CT career fair and the parents are getting involved, they're doing projects, you're talking about all their programs and highlighting them, talking about the completers in their entirety and getting feedback overall from them and that also the PTA or families help to actually host the event. Provide a description of the project and include photos. STEM career fair. School sponsored a STEM career fair or similar event during the 1920 academic year. This may consist of highlighting all of your programs at your school, also having different businesses, organizations, universities, and colleges coming into your school, anything that you may have hosted specifically um, for STEM career fair during the 1920 year, sponsored by your school. Provide a description of project can also include the photos. ITEA memberships. School has an active ITEA integrative STEM school membership for 20 points at the time of application. School staff are ITEA members, five points per member on staff. An active member status at the time of application is required. So please provide individuals names and the member number. Conference presentation. Teacher or administrator delivered a STEM or STEAM education conference presentation during the 2019-2020 academic year. Please provide the conference title, date, session, title, and the name of presenters. ITEA conference attendance. So the teacher or administrator attended the 2020 ITEA 
International Conference in Baltimore. Five points per attendee. And please provide the names of the attendees. So the STEM CTL in, um, admin strand. So a principal participated in administrator strand at the 2020 ITEA International Conference in Baltimore. The ITEA STEM Showcase. So teachers or administrators participated in the STEM Showcase at ITEA's 2020 International Conference in Baltimore. Peer-reviewed STEM or STEAM publication. STEM or STEAM um, education publication by staff member in a peer-reviewed journal for 20 points. If you provide the completed article citation and provide the article URL if available. Engineering by design integrative STEM curriculum. At least one engineering by design course was taught in the 2019-2020 school year. And you'll list teacher names and the courses taught. ITEA's Idea Garden Forum. If a staff member posted to Idea Garden for 10 points, please provide the member name, title, and the date of the post. STEM Connections. This is a newsletter for integrative STEM education professionals. So if you posted a school event in the STEM Connections monthly electronic newsletter, you'll be awarded the 10 points. Provide member name, date, and the title and descriptions. Technology Student Association, an active TSA chapter for the 2019-2020 school year, you'll be awarded 20 points. Provide the TSA advisor name and chapter number. Technology Student Association event. Participation in a TSA event during the 2019-2020 school year. Provide TSA advisor name and event. Professional learning. The staff member participated in ITEA's STEM Center for Teaching and Learning professional learning event during the 2019-2020 school year. So you have iSTEM, ED, PLC, EBD Summer Institutes, or EBD Webinars. Provide staff member's name, dates, and the title of the professional development event. STEM Spotlight. Staff STEM Spotlight participant during the 2019-2020 school year. Provide link to your STEM Spotlight feature. STEM Lab Safety Protocol. Establish a safety protocol for your STEM lab and post it on your classroom or school website. This is awarded 20 points. Provide the link to your safety protocol document. Engineering by Design course author, reviewer, or focus group participant. The staff member served as an EBD course author, reviewer, or focus group participant during the 2019-2020 school year. Provide the name of the participant and course. How to apply. By clicking on this link or go to www.ita.org slash STEM School of Excellence, you will see the application form. You'll be able to view this form before submitting. Awards are made at two levels. You have the ITA STEM School of Excellence, 200 plus points, and the STEM School of Merit from 170 to 199 points. The application window is open for this school year until December 1st, 2020. This is for that 2019-2020 school year. 
And again, award recipients will be recognized at the virtual conference this year, March 24th to 27th, 2021. Not quite ready for this year. Looking for guidance in establishing your STEM school this year. So we encourage teachers, administrators, and other stakeholders to use the STEM School of Excellence application as a guide. So using this guide, you can create a strategic plan for putting a selection of the qualifying criteria into place during the 2020-2021 school year. Register a STEAM teacher or STEM teacher and administrators for ITEA's 2021 virtual conference to attend the admin strand, STEM showcase, and other relevant conference sessions and get involved in all that ITEA and the STEM Center for Teaching and Learning have to offer. Frequently asked questions. What's the difference between a STEM or a School of Excellence and a School of Merit? So School of Merit is one that attains between the 177 to 199 points during that review process. A School of Excellence attains over 200 points on the same scale. What grade levels can apply to be a School of Excellence? Elementary, middle, and high schools are all eligible to apply. How many schools are selected each year? There is no limit. Those that qualify are selected. Does the application provide an exact formula to determine a STEM school of excellence? No, every school is different. Be specific and descriptive when providing documentation and explain why you feel it qualifies. And to follow up with additional questions, please utilize this form located at the top and any additional questions, please feel free to reach out to both Ryan and myself. Our emails are listed here.
For more information, please visit iteea.org. Thank you.